Hey there guys, Matt Guzman here, back with another video, and today's going to be my October status update of Eagle Scout in only two years. I would have posted yesterday, but it was Halloween, and I was busy Halloweening. So, here's the quick overview. There are 7 Scout ranks, 16 leadership positions, and 21 merit badges that are required for Eagle Scout. Now, for the ranks, I have Scout rank, Tenderfoot, uh, Second Class, <laughs> First Class, Star Scout, and I'm currently Life Scout and very close to Eagle Scout. So that is six out of these seven ranks in scouting. Now, for leadership positions, I have been a quartermaster, den chief, patrol leader, currently instructor at the moment, and I've also been senior patrol leader, and I'm pretty sure I'm unofficially a senior, uh, assistant senior patrol leader. Um, my, on the scout book records, it says I'm instructor, so that's six out of the 16 leadership positions. The only thing is, I asked my SPL multiple times, and I'm pretty sure I'm still on the uh, the leadership team, because he keeps saying that I'm still his ASPL, so I don't see it in the records, so I'm going to ask about that, but every time I ask the, the SPL, he keeps saying he wants me as ASPL still, so I guess I'm both instructor and assistant senior patrol leader, which I don't mind, I just, if they're both in the record, that'd be nice. Anyway, I've, um, as I said before, I'm a Life Scout, got that completed well over six months ago. To be a Life Scout, you needed to be active at least six months as a Star Scout. Uh, you needed to demonstrate Scout Spirit, also earn five more merit badges, so you had 11 in total. Participate in six hours of service, with three of them being conservation related. Be active in six months in a position of responsibility. And also use the Edge Method to teach another Scout a Scout skill. <laughs> Now, Eagle Scout, 89% of the way there. Well, that's a big jump from my 73% from last month because your boy got his Eagle Scout project done. Heck yeah. So, six months as a Life Scout, got that completed. Tournament Merit Badges, with 13 of them being Eagle, got that completed. Six months in a leadership role, got that completed. And my Eagle Scout service project, I got that completed. All I need is the big border review and I'll be done. I mean, there's still a few more things I need to do, but requirement-wise, I just need I just need the board of review, and I'll discuss that in a second. Now, last month on my channel, we did how to repair your home in Scouts, which is the Home Repair Merit Badge. Also, my monthly live stream, which happens on the second Saturday of every month on uh, 12 o'clock noon Eastern Time. And I'll explain more of that in a second. Also, I did what is the Space Coast Light Fest Boy Scout events because I have my Light Fest tomorrow. So I made the video of it last week explaining what it was. Home repair. Basically, it's self explanatory. Just repair stuff around your house. You can build stuff, repair things, construct things. And in the video, I also showed an example of things I've also did or done. On the left, there's a broken cup. On the right, there's a fixed cup. Boom. Easy. Definitely not two separate cups, but uh, yeah. It's repairing stuff, doesn't have to be good, it just needs to be repaired. Also, yes, my live stream, usually I have Q&A live streams on the second Saturday every month, and this one's going to be a little different. 12 o'clock noon Eastern Time on the second Saturday of November, I will be doing a special Q&A because it's also going to be a fundraiser for me. I needed to purchase materials for my Eagle Scout project, and I need to gain money in order to pay those uh, funds back. So, I need your guys' help. Anything, literally just one dollar would mean the world to me. But I'm not gonna beg for money, I'm just gonna kindly request you donate what you can to me, so I can get my stuff paid off and I'll be good. Um, my goal is, I think, $533. Um, I'll say what the exact amount is during the live stream, but I need just a little bit over $500. Um, and if, if I don't get that much, no sweat, just, I'll just get, I'll just get it eventually from my videos over time. But if you can help out, 12 o'clock noon Eastern time, two weeks from now. And yeah, I'll also be doing my Q&A as well. So more about that later in the video. Space Coast Light Fest, I talked about what Light Fest is, my part in it, and you know just how it works, what the event is, definitely check that out. By the way, this and Home Repair will both be linked in the description. Badges, I have a lot, so let's just get to it. I have First Aid, Swimming, 
citizenship in the world, cycling, personal management, environmental science, citizenship in the nation, camping, cooking, emergency preparedness, fa uh, communications, family life, uh, citizenship in the community, and personal fitness. Um, because of these being either or merit badges, that is still 13 out of 13 Eagle required. I still have 14, but it just counts for 13 because I've already explained that. For non-Eagle required badges, it, it's a lot, so let's get to it. Chess, music, art, movie making, scholarship, uh, Indian lore, animation, robotics, digital technology, fingerprinting, railroading, public speaking, archaeology, public health, game design, chemistry, home repair, scouting heritage, reading, uh, salesmanship, American culture, and my luck, it goes over to the next slide by one, American heritage. So counting that all up, actually I just want to go back one slide just to show you guys, ooh, look at that collection and also just the one here, that is 22 non-Eagle required merit badges, which means my 14 Eagle required plus the 22 here is the 36 I needed for my goal, which is very, very nice. So that's my merit badges. Now time for how I think COVID-19 is affecting scouts and my troop. So, meetings are in person and online. What I've seen recently in my troop and in other troops is they're doing a mix. Uh, my troop, for instance, is alternating between online meetings and in person. We're kind of doing every other week is in person and online. So that's pretty cool. Troop events are also still being planned while keeping in mind social distancing. Uh, since Lenochi is gaining traction again, I know they've been camping for a while, but my troop is not comfortable with going to Lenochi as well, so we're planning stuff there. Also, I've helped two friends in their Eagle projects, and I finished my Eagle project and turned in my workbook. I haven't completed all my paperwork, but I turned in the stages, the three stages. There's like, there's like the proposal, the, um, the report during it, and then the after report of the review. I don't know the exact names, but I turned in all the a lot of good jazz, and I signed up for Winter Camp at Lenochi, and I'm pretty sure that's going to be my last camp out before I age out, because I age out in a few months, so I'm pretty sure the Winter Camp one is most likely going to be my last one with the troop, so it's going to be sad times, but it's going to be a great time. Also, progress on my scouting career, speaking of me aging out. I'm very close to Eagle Scout, as I just said, got my project done, because I turned in a few more things. I also, surprisingly, I got elected in the Order of the Arrow by my troop. I know last month I said I was not interested in it, but then I'm like, eh, whatever. I'm getting Eagle Scout soon, might as well. So I'm not exactly sure what's happening next, because it's supposed to be like a secretive kind of thing. Every time I ask one of my friends who's in Order of the Arrow, they're like, I guess you'll find out. And I'm like, I guess I will. So I'm not exactly sure what's happening next. I, I think either someone in the troop is going to tell me something or I'm going to get an email from somebody. I don't know. <laughs> we'll find out. Also, I completed four merit badges in the past month and home repair, but that was like, that was kind of the month before. So this month I completed four merit badges, which is very nice. So, which means, as I said, I finally got all 36 merit badges for the Eagle Scout Palms. And if I'm not mistaken, they changed the rules to where if you have all those merit badges, when you get Eagle Scout, you also get all those palms on the spot. That's why I've been wanting to get 36, because I get the first three palms right out of the bat. And also that I'm aging out in a few months, so it's kind of nice I'm kind of wrapping everything up. So it's going to be very, very great. My badges I'm working on now, hiking and backpacking. I think I might get them by January, I'm not sure, it just depends on the plans that my troop makes. I mean, if I'm able to get them, you know, I might as well, but for the time being, I'm not too worried about them since I have all my merit badges. I'm working on law, uh, mining and society, and weather. So if I do get all those, it'll be plus five to my collection of merit badges. <laughs> Progress on my Eagle project. So, on October 17th, I finished my Eagle Scout project in one day as scheduled and completed the three stages in the workbook. I also sent in my paperwork for approval, uh, which means that, you know, as I said before, consistent communication is important. 
because if you don't have that, then plans will fall through and things might get lost. Let's make sure you're keeping consistent communication. If you're doing an Eagle Scout project, that's what I'm trying to do, making sure everything is turned in correctly. Now all I have to do is collect my references and turn in my Eagle Rank application and do the essay. So they're, they're all just like little parts of the, of the entire thing. But once I get them all done, then, you know, I'll be set. It was just getting the project coordinated. That was the hard part. Now it's just the tedious parts, you know, just getting all this stuff in. So consistent communication, very important. So that is the progress on my Eagle project. Also, little sneak peek. As I mentioned before, I said my Eagle Scout project was to lead, direct, and supervise the construction of benches and railings on an existing dock. Now, here's the before picture. Kind of, you know, just a dock with a overgrowth and stuff. Then, wham! Ooh! Fancy benches, like, uh, part, part of the walkway also been replaced and railings put up. It's very, very nice. That was my project. And on my live stream for this for this month as i said before second saturday of the month 12 o'clock noon eastern time although i will be doing a q a it will be focused on my fundraising to get all the stuff paid off for my eagle project as i have already said so yeah please show up be answering any questions i'll be going through my procedures my planning my the different stages of my project do a little before during and after pictures and videos all that good stuff so yeah just show up mark it on your calendar support me any way you can and yes that is my eagle scout project the palms, as I mentioned before, I will I will be getting the first three, and they're all 50% because now I need to actually get Eagle Scout, and then I'll get the palms. So the bronze one, 50%, gold one, 50%, and silver one, 50%. If I get the extra five that I'm wanting, then I also might get another bronze one, but that's only if I get Eagle Scout within the next month. And I'm also staying on top of the mirror badges. I'm not too worried about the fourth one. I just want the first three because, you know, all the colors look cool. <laughs> so, yes, that's what that. Home repair. I got that finished, as I said before. Scouting heritage. I also got that completed. I did videos for both of those. They will be linked in the description. The four that I've gotten recently is reading, uh, as I already mentioned. Uh, to get this merit badge, obviously, you have to do some reading, which isn't too bad. On the left is a picture of, like, a corner for reading. You know, just a nice, quiet place where you can read. You can read in your library, read in your room, read in, like, a corner like this. Just anywhere. Literally just taking, like, 15 to 30 minutes every day just to read something. You can get this merit badge done really fast. Just, like, keep track of what you read and the genre of it. All that good stuff. If, you're not, if you don't know what books to read, you can always look in your school library. You can look at your books at home. The picture on the right is actually a bookshelf that my dad has. I've read almost all those books there. Um, on the on not, not all the encyclopedias. No, I haven't read those. But everything on that second layer, I've read almost all of those. So, yeah, just reading, very fun. And you don't have to, like think like, oh, I gotta read a book. Read stuff you're interested in, you know? Like, for example, I read The Hobbit. Well, I'm still reading it, but it's such a great book. I would highly recommend it. So yeah, reading merit badge. <laughs> Salesmanship. Got that completed. The 10% is gone. It's now an added zero to 100%. Got that completed. Woo! Also, American culture. I got this completed as well, along with American heritage. So, videos on all four of these videos, wait, no, videos on all four of these merit badges will come out eventually. I still need to finish personal fitness because I, I promised that to you guys a while ago. I am getting it done, I promise. Um, American Heritage is kind of a cool merit badge because, I mean, American culture is good as well. I just enjoyed American Heritage more because it's about, like, the history of America, stuff like that. On the left, for the there's a requirement where you had to reword a certain portion of the Declaration of Independence. So uh, I, that was kind of fun, and also flexing the two dollar bill I have. But you know, it was very nice reading the Declaration of Independence, trying to understand why it happened, and also the like, just trying to reword it. It's very nice. Also on the right side, there are the different flags that have happened over the like the course of America. Um, starting with like the 13 star flag, ending with the 50 star flag. Actually, it starts with this weird union flag, but you know, with the stars, it starts off with the 13 colonies. 
So, you know, it's just nice seeing the progression of flags and, like, the different the different changes they've made to it. So, yes, American Heritage, very nice merit badge. I will be doing videos on all of these pretty soon. Hiking, I am 73% of the way there. Along with backpacking, 72% of the way there. As I said before, I will get these done if my troop makes plans to do it, because they most likely will. Mining and Society, I'm 71%. I just need to find a counselor, and I'm set. Weather, I'm 33% of the way there. Um, I don't know why that popped up. It just looks cool. I'm going to get this done within the next week because the merit badge is insanely simple, so I'm going to get this done soon. Also, pets, 17% of the way there because I am working on that. I was planning on raising sea monkeys, you know, like the things where you, you like... You, they're like the packets of like the eggs and you put them in this special water and they hatch and it's like whoa Except I think mine died. So I might just be getting fish, but we don't talk about that uh, Law zero percent because I'm not exactly sure what I'm gonna do with this merit badge because I'm I'm honestly not even sure if the merit badge University is still available for this So we'll just see what happens. I'll ask but those are the merit badges. I'm working on and thank you for watching my very cool, and actually I like the status update a lot, I got so much done. And if you also liked it, and enjoyed it, please like the video, turn on notifications on my channel, and I will see you not only in the next video, I will see you on my live stream two weeks from now. So, have a great rest of your day.